Hi guys, welcome to my channel. So today's video is all about the new Huda Beauty Foundation review. I'm going to be doing the review of the new Huda Beauty Foundation right here for you guys. It's a stick foundation. The foundation was also launched with a primer which looks like so. It's called the Huda Beauty Water Jelly Primer and that's what the packaging looks like. So I'm just going to quickly get into the video and share my thoughts about the foundation with you guys so we don't want this video to be too long. I'm going to start with the wow, primer first. That felt so, so lightweight on the skin. I can feel it. As you guys can tell, it's moving. So I'm just going to blend that in right there. So, so lightweight on the skin and it sunk into my skin immediately and it has not smelled sweet whatsoever that's so so good i like that it you know blends into the skin really really well and very very lightweight i got three shades with me so i'm not quite sure which one is the best one for so i'm just gonna go with so i've got actually got three shades of this foundation with me so Let's give this a shot. This is called Big Net. Let's see. Hmm. I think this is actually my shade. This is the darkest shade from the three. Guys, look at that. Look at that. The coverage is really, really good. Wow. I love the coverage. Very, very good. It's full coverage, as you can tell. It covers all my imperfection really well, and at the same time, it's really, really lightweight on my skin. So, I'm gonna use this shade. I'll put the name on the screen for you guys to see, because I might not be pronouncing it very well. So, among the three, this is the darkest one that they sent to me. So, yeah. As you can tell, that blends in really, really well into my skin. So what do you guys think? Is this my shade or should I go a shade lighter? But as far as I can tell, I think this blends into my skin really well. Look at that. As you guys can tell, I've got all this imperfection going on. Probably due to the marks that we've been <laughs> wearing lately, but yeah. So I'm just going to try the other side as well. Look at that. It covers so, so well. Wow. <laughs> I'm just going to blend that in with the brush that came with the foundation. It blends really, really well. Very, very easy to work with. And the coverage is really, really good as well. Look at that. As I said, I'm using the darkest shade from the, the finished look. After blending the foundation into my skin, I'm just going to go ahead and apply my concealer. I think I'm not going to use concealer because I've got a lighter shade here called, called Baklava. So, yep, yeah, we're going to try and use that. Come to, you know, experiment with it as a foundation and also as a concealer due to the fact that it's a full coverage foundation. So I'm using Baklava as my concealer. It's lighter than the one that I used earlier. So let's see how that works out for me. This is can also work out as a concealer. It depends on how well you, you know, blend it. The one that I use as foundation has a red undertone, while this one that I use my use as my concealer has a yellow undertone. So I'm going to use this Fenty Beauty Bloating Powder. I'm going to use that to set it into my skin. I love, love, love the coverage of the foundation. Very, very lightweight and at the same time, it's very, very full coverage. As you can tell, it's all done. <laughs> all my spots and all those imperfections disappeared. Can we do the same on the other side as well? Because we get as light as it can get. On this part as well. Not your mama pantyhose, I like to like there. Oh, look at that. The glow is blinding. Ooh, the glow is blinding. Right.
hi guys so this is the finished look so far so good i'm loving the finished look i loved how everything blends in really well and i also like the fact that the coverage of the foundation is really amazing i don't know if you got that sound there is an alarm going off somewhere around me so i would like to block you guys here with that so to we'll conclude this review in another video because the noise is way too loud so you guys might not be able to hear me and there's no point for me going on if you can't hear me but so far so good i love the coverage of the foundation i love the packaging of the foundation and i also love the fact that the foundation blends in really well into my skin i love how effortless it is to blend with brush or either uh, beauty blender you can get away with any of them so that for me is uh, you know amazing you don't have to use a beauty blender to blend your cream foundation maybe this is just me I love the fact that I could use the brush to blend it the brush is really really fine and really soft so it helps blending the foundation really well into my skin I love how easy it is to work with the foundation you know you don't have to apply too much to get the coverage you're looking for just apply it once and you're good to go and i also love the fact that the foundation can also be used as a foundation and also as a concealer so that for me is a no-brainer so yeah i think the noise is way too much guys in my opinion would i recommend this foundation yes i will it's a no-brainer in terms of the primer i really really love that as well it's very lightweight on the skin and at the same time it's sinking to the skin really well the fragrance, it doesn't have any fragrance in my opinion and I like the fact that it's, you know, sink into, it sunk into my skin really well without any issue whatsoever and also let, helps in, you know, melting the foundation into my skin if that makes sense. So yes, I would definitely recommend the foundation, the brush and also the primer. So that's the end of today's video let me try my best to conclude you know the review in another video because the noise is way too much so thank you guys so much for watching thank you guys so much for all your support and don't forget to subscribe to my channel if you're new to my channel don't forget to thumbs up video if you like it and let me know what you like to see on my channel and thank you so much for watching guys i'll see you in my next one bye guys